I haven't done any training runs uh, with Mr. Testicles uh, purely for the fact that he's normally up in Birmingham and it's a logistical nightmare. And also, if I run out on the street, unless it's a closed road, you can you can barely see. You've got such tunnel vision, you can you can only really make out what's just in front of you. I have been training with a weight vest um, to, to try and compensate for the weight because he weighs just over a stone. So I've been doing about 25 to 30 miles a week and some weeks. Uh, my long runs are up to about 17, 18. It, it's going to be difficult, um, mainly because they're saying the weather's, the, the temperature's really going to increase in this side as a fan to suck in air. It can only suck in so much um, and you have to keep swapping batteries out because they don't last the full race either. Uh, it, it's very easy to to run in a suit like this because nobody can actually see who's inside it. Because I'm, I'm normally quite a shy person, so being in front of a camera and interviews and the, the, all the things surrounding Mr. Testicles has been probably like one of the hardest parts. I'd much rather be inside the suit and then continue running to where there's nobody around me and then take the suit off, but I don't really want to run any more than 26 miles in him. I've had a lot of people wishing me good luck so far, which is really positive. Although quite a few of them still don't know what Mr. Testicles is about, but as the race goes on, that'll change. Anywhere near me for a while.